And my dad worked a lot. And so getting to spend quality time with him uh, was through our time on the weekends and we got to do stuff through Royal Rangers. They taught you some practical life skills, even I was seven years old, and learning how to tie knots and some basic first aid. But we also learned Bible verses and scripture and just life lessons about integrity and honesty. When you're young, your father is your hero. He's your first hero. So you always want to spend time with him. And so getting to spend time with my dad was great. And Royal Rangers was really fun for me because we were doing things with other boys my age. So I have two boys now and getting to raise boys is a lot of fun for me uh, because I had a good experience when I was a kid. I started thinking about maybe starting a something similar to what Royal Rangers was and it was difficult because I didn't know where to start. We had an opening in our life group actually and uh, Josh Obermiller and his wife Kelly joined our group and he and I along with some other guys in our life group ended up going on a camping trip and Josh rode with me and we started talking about our life and how people had influenced our life and the relationships that we had. It, we really got to the roots of our passion and we wanted to do this together and he told me he was just ready to jump right in with me. And Josh and Kelly had just bought five acres of wooded land and said, well, let's just have a camping event and we'll invite the dads and their boys and we'll teach them how to start a fire and, and how to do safety with a, with a, with a hatchet and an ax because there's going to be you know, those elements around a campfire, so we'll teach them something about safety. I think we had probably 12 or 14 dads and almost 17 or 20 kids. We didn't really have plans after that. We just knew that that was going to be who would show up. And whoever showed up, we decided we would start inviting them to more events. And we titled it Young Warriors because we felt like boys needed to realize that warriors aren't just in the movies. Warriors are their dad or their uncle or their grandpa. And not in the sense of military warrior, but just as being a man. And we called it Young Warriors also to tie in with the dads to make help them to remember that you know they have a job to do and that is to raise their son uh, to be a man but a man being a part of being a man is to know how to fight and how to stand up for things that uh, are important like God your family your country your friends Andy Stanley had said that the number one thing you want to do is strengthen strengthen your relationship with your kids and when you strengthen your relationship with your kids, the only way to do that is to spend time with them. And that is to have relationship with them by spending, taking time and intentionally doing something that interests them and you and you're doing it together. Uh, one thing that I have found beneficial for my boys and I through Young Warriors is me being around other dads. Uh, honestly, seeing how other dads interact with their boys and I, I've seen dads who are really patient with their boys and I, I've realized that I can do better being patient as well. So really it's been seeing other dads and how they are with their son has helped me improve how I am with my boys.